All right, all right. How's my hair? How's my hair? What about what about the makeup? What about the makeup? You, you like hey everyone! <laughs> I got my package from Hollis Eve today. I just opened it. I haven't looked in yet. Um, I did grab my little card. Um, they always give me a nice little card, which I really appreciate. Um, so let's get on in here. I see napkins. Ooh, they're like Halloween napkins. Name your poison. That's pretty cool. I have some leftover Halloween napkins from last year, and these will look really good with it. I I like things. I really like these. Thank you. And what are you? Oh, it's like a cool, I'm going to say hippie bag. I don't know if that's what you guys call, if what people call them, but that's what I always call them. And, ooh, it's got, what's up? Got a big pocket in there. And a pocket on the outside. Oh, I love the colors. So fall and beautiful. Thank you so much for this beautiful fall bag. It's got some cool, like, patchwork on it. I did it neat. I might use it today. It matches my hair. Are you seeing that? Totally matches my hair. I went like super big wings today. I've been doing this thing where I don't go all the way. I just, I go halfway on my lid. And it makes these really big wings, which is pretty awesome. So, I'll be probably, I've been doing that a lot lately. So, I'll probably be doing it more. So, my friend Amanda is going to be, with my hair, is going to be doing a craft show here in a couple weeks. And she really wanted me to be a part of it, but it's going to be like an all-day thing. And I didn't think I'd get a babysitter. But luckily, my mother-in-law and father-in-law are going to take the kids for a few hours so that I can help her with this craft show. And you get to dress up. So she has like a steampunk theme going on with her um, booth. So we're going to go kind of steampunk. But it's also kind of like a Halloween expo thing. So I was going to try and do like a Halloween or like a steampunk witch of sorts. But I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it look as cool as I see it in my head. But she's going to be doing black and red color palette. So I thought I would do, like, mustard yellow and black. And just, like, I don't know. I thought it would be cool if we, like, we were similar, but we were, you know, different. And um, so she came over and we crafted a bit. And so she had all these really cool stick-on, um, I don't even know, I guess, like, just stickers. But this was one, and she let me have, because I had a bunch of jars, and I gave her a few of mine that I didn't really use. So, she let me have this one, because I love house. And this one that says, enjoy these deadly morsels. I thought for the party, because the cool thing about this is not only will it be cool for Halloween, but it'll also look really awesome for the Harry Potter party coming up. And I don't know what to put in it. I was thinking like squishy eyeballs or something. Can't like that candy and go from there. And then um, I actually had some Harry Potter stickers that I never thought about putting on jars. I always used like this little sticker book or not really a sticker book, but like this weird booklet thing that I had made. Um, it's like a, I was like, it's a witch's journal, but all of the Harry Potter and stuff. Um, but one of the stickers was, like, Weasley's stuff from their joke shop. And this is Weasley's Weather in a Bottle. And I just happened to have a bottle. And we filled it up with stuff that reminded us of his weather. Like, the bottom is tissue paper that's supposed to signify water. And then the pebbles are supposed to be, like, hail. The tissue is supposed to be, like, snow. And then we have some leaves in there to signify wind. So it's Weasley's Weather in a Bottle. I mean, come on, that's... Super cool and dorky. And then this last one, it's full of bullet shells. Um, she gave me her other owl sticker, which was really cool. I'm surprised she gave them all to me. And then I have an earring that I put on top of it, but it doesn't look as cool as I had hoped. I don't know. Does it look cool? Maybe if I put it out in the middle or something. Who knows? Um, but yeah. So I made those and been putting those around the house. I kind of left all the stuff out because I thought I might do more, but I, I don't know if I will or not. I just hadn't had a chance to kind of do that yet. Um, 
So that's pretty much what I've been doing lately. I know I haven't been doing as many videos as I normally would. I normally like throw out two or three a week, but I just, I don't know if it wasn't like I was in the mood or just life. Like I got, um, I got kind of sick after the steampunk party and started, I just was not really into life right then. And so I was just sort of taking it slow and then, um, I've been having a really hard time with this, like, the schedule of getting up early. Like, I've been going to bed fairly early, but maybe I'm just not going to bed early enough. I don't know, but that stuff's going on. So, that sucks, but whatevs. Stuff happens. So, I hope this video is fun. It's a little short video. Normally, I talk a lot, but I'm trying not to do that so much. I know some of you like that, but... I just, I feel like I don't have anything interesting to say, and I, I don't like prolonging the inevitable. I'm like, I'm just, I just, I just, I don't know. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else coming up other than Halloween and the Halloween party. Oh my gosh, it's like, um, yeah, so the craft show is going to be on the 18th, and then the following week is going to be, um, our Halloween party, and then the week after that. It's gonna be Halloween. Oh my God! Next week is our fall festival, so I'm gonna I'm gonna have lots of videos coming up. There's gonna be at least one video per week, and I'm doing a lot of stuff. I'm pretty much busy all October. That's the great thing. Like October is like my busiest month because we have our fall, annual fall festival. Um, the very first week. Well, I guess technically it's it's still the first week because. Like, October just started a couple days ago, so, but whatever. Um, so, yeah, next, next week, then next Monday, actually, technically, it kind of already started, but it doesn't, uh, I don't think we're going to be able to get to it until Monday, because that's when Andrew's off. So, that's our, our fall festival, which is, like, games, rides, fried, every kind of fried food you could possibly want or don't want, but they have it anyway. Um, but there's, like, fried butter and fried, like, slushies, which just sound gross to me, but okay, that's pe some people are into that, and then, you know, then the craft show is coming up, and then the party, and then Halloween, so there's gonna, there's gonna be a lot of stuff going on for me, and it doesn't ever really end until next spring, it's like spring and summer, I only have, like, one or two parties, he is totally picking his nose in the background, you see him there, oh my god, hi, Ben. I saw that! He was doing this number! Did you see that? You're such a goob! Anyway, um, yeah, and then there's November, which, that's kind of like a cooling off period, but then it gets really cold and snowy and blah, and, and then there's December, which is Christmas and all that nonsense. <laughs> so, I'm just gonna try and enjoy October, because October is my favorite month. And, um, the fall, fall is here, and it feels amazing outside. It's like, uh, th yesterday they said the high was going to be 55, but the high today is going to be 73, which is awesome. And then I think tomorrow's going to get, like, the high's going to be, like, 60-something, and then it's going to be, like, 70s and 60s throughout the week. And I just, I, I'm just, couldn't be more pleased. That just sounds awesome. So that's what I'll be doing, and I'm going to be hanging out with, like, family and friends and stuff down at Fall Fest, so it's just, it's just going to be awesome. I'm just, I'm just so excited. Th great things are coming, guys. Great things are coming, and I'll try, I know at least one day I'll do tons of video clippage of the Fall Festival and show you guys how cool the rides and stuff are, even though I don't ride any of them. Not because I'm scared, but because I get extremely nauseous super easy on rides. And so it's just, it's just not a good idea for me. It, it pretty much ruins my entire day. So I go for the food and to like hang out with people and just to have fun with the family. And then the kids, well, Nora and Andrew will be probably riding all the rides and then me and I will just hang out and walk around and meet people. And, and then there's, you know, they, I mean, they have really good food and then sometimes they have like shows and stuff, which my, my Cousin, second cousin, is going to be in one of the shows, so I'm not going to be able to make it, and I feel bad. So I'm going to miss it that day. But it'll be fun. It'll be really good. I, I, I just, yeah, it'll be good. Just prepare for all that fun stuff, and hopefully this, you guys like this video, and I, yeah. 
Oh, I also want a disclaimer. Um, I don't own any of the music that is playing in this background. There is a movie playing in the background as well. Like, I don't, I don't own anything. It's just there. It's my background. It's just there. I just don't want to have to, like, write that down, because sometimes if I forget, they'll, they'll cut off the audio on my videos. I'm like, why? Okay, so, um, yeah, thank you, Trish and Pam, so much. I love you guys. You guys are the greatest. And I know things are kind of meh right now, but, um, I don't really know what's going on, but all I can say is, um, I know it's so cliche, but with time, you know, it does get better. So, but I love you guys, and I'm just so, so happy to be a part of everything you guys do, and if you ever need me for anything, just please don't hesitate to ask, because I'm, I'm just, that's what I'm here for. It's, I just, I love it. So, I love you guys. All right. Bye.